Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be making a quick basil stir fry. So let's get started. Here I have some onions, some broccoli, some bok choy, zucchini, bell peppers, some mushrooms, some snow peas, and of course the star of the show, the fresh basil. We're gonna go ahead now and mix our sauce. So in a bowl, we're gonna combine our oyster sauce. We're also gonna go ahead and add our sweet soy sauce. And I'm also gonna go ahead and add some fish sauce as well. Guys, all the ingredients will be listed in the description box below, so please don't forget to check it out. I'm also going to go ahead and add some sugar. So, I'm going to go ahead and add my sugar and mix this bad boy and set it aside. I will not be using all of this sauce because I'm going to be making something else as well that consists of the same sauce. So, in a frying pan, I'm going to heat up some oil and I'm going to go ahead and add my onions and my chilies and I'm going to just give it a quick um, stir. And I'm also going to go ahead and add some chopped garlic. You can also add chopped ginger as well, but I didn't add any, so I didn't add any ginger. So this is just chopped garlic and onion and chilies. So now I'm going to go ahead and add my broccoli. I'm going to add my snow peas. I'm going to add my zucchini and my bell peppers and my mushrooms and my bok choy. I'm adding it this way because I don't want the vegetable to lose tons of water because... I will not be using any um, cornstarch because I do not like cornstarch in my vegetables. So now I'm going to go ahead and add some black pepper like so. I'm going to go ahead and add about four, 3 to 4 teaspoons of the sauce and give it a quick stir. Again, I do not like to overpower my vegetables as well with the sauce. But I'm just going to go ahead give it a quick stir. And the star of the show, the fresh basil. Toss that around. Add about 3 teaspoons more of the sauce give it a mix and that's it guys our stir fry is looking amazing and it's ready and the vegetables are not fully cooked it still has a little crunch to it so now guys i'm gonna go ahead and serve this up with some rice or you can serve this up just like it is and serve it with some sesame seeds sprinkle on top i hope you guys like this video please don't forget to subscribe and share and until next time guys please stay safe bye